All right, well, I just saw that the Halo TV series comes out in March. There is a teaser trailer. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I love Halo. I even like some of their books. This is, um, this is one called Halo Ghosts of Onyx. I also like uh, Halo The Fall of Reach, amongst some others. So, yeah, big Halo fan. Full disclosure, this is not, this is not sponsored by Microsoft Halo or Paramount+. Plus. So, yeah, so for copyright reasons, I can't even play the video for you. But I will play it um, off screen here and give you my quick reaction. I'll make it short, uh, but full disclosure, I love Halo. I don't have the last Halo game because um, I didn't feel like buy buying an external hard drive or a new Xbox. So also, I, I probably would have bought Halo Infinite. I've seen a Halo I Infinite on YouTube. It looks pretty good. Coming March 24th. Oh, my birthday. The Spartan, Master Chief. All right, so it looks like production value looks good. There's Dr. Halsey, I believe. The Spartans. Looks good. Ah, the energy sword. Oh, I want that Jeep. I want that Halo Jeep. It's called the Warthog. I think it's called the Warthog, yeah. And, um, oh, that was weird. I'll have to go back and look at that. Um, all right, the voice of Master Chief. I don't think it's the original voice, the actor, voice actor Steve Downs. They picked somebody else, which is fine. It looks good. It looks good. A superhuman you're not sure you can trust. Cortana looks different. That's Master Chief's AI helper. All right, the Covenant, the evil Covenant. Halsey looks hot. Anyway. Ugh. That looked nasty. The deadliest weapon. That would be the Master Chief to save humanity. Our deadliest weapon is our greatest hope. Okay. All right, so Halo's uh, TV series streams March 24th on Paramount+. Plus. Um, uh, it looks like they spent some money on this. Production value, briefly, from what I saw, looks good. The Master Chief, the, the costume or what he wears, looks like the game, looks like the Master Chief. I think the actor's name is um, Pablo Schreiber. I don't know the actor. But it looks. Um, this looks like it's going to be a good one. I believe it's a 10-part series. Uh, let me go back. I thought I saw something weird. Maybe not. I mean, it, these these teaser trailers play so fast that sometimes you miss stuff until you play it back. But I thought something. I thought I saw something. Let me fast forward just a notch here. Maybe it's nothing. I love that Jeep, the Halo Warthog, the four-wheel drive, four-wheel steer. That's what we need in the snowstorm here in Ohio. That kind, right? Huh. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not an expert on cars, but what's what's a Chevy uh, Tahoe, a Chevy something? What's a Chevy truck, a Chevy SUV doing 500 years in the future? Play this back at around the 48, 49 second mark, freeze frame it. And if you look to the left, <laughs> it looks like there's a Chevy truck. I mean, come on, not even Hondas and Toyotas last that long because this takes place 500 years in the future. I don't know if that's a blooper or is that, is that going to be CGI'd out, but that looks like a Chevy, uh, I want to say Tucson, but that's not right. I will say it's a Chevy uh, Tahoe 500 years in the future. I mean, if it was a Honda or Toyota, but, no, no, but come on, man. Okay, that's what I'm going to say. It looks good. Uh, big Halo fan. This looks like it's going to be high production value, well, uh, money well spent starting March 24th on Paramount+. Plus. Check out the Halo TV series with the 500-year-old Chevy Tahoe.